Well, we've seen NFL Commissioner Roger Goodell and NFL PA Executive Director Demora Smith exchanging, shall we say, pleasantries through the media. We've seen them in front of Congress. And as the two sides attempt to negotiate a new collective bargaining agreement, the atmosphere is only going to get more tense. We know Goodell. He's been on the job for three years. But who is this man the players have chosen to lead them during this tumultuous time? For our last practice, we can play hit coach. Yeah! Hit coach! Yeah. Yes. Yes. Do hit coach. Oh, hit coach. This is fun for Demora Smith. He's the executive director of the NFL Players Association by day and a coach for his 10 year old son Alex and his baseball team in Silver Spring, Maryland by night. Nice, nice, nice. Tag him. Good job, man. The intensity and passion you see here is the backbone of Smith's day job as union chief. Walking into the toughest job in America. Named the successor to the late and legendary Gene Upshaw in March, the man everyone calls D has not slowed down. Uh, I've been on the job for uh, six months. I've probably been on the road three and a half, four months solid. He was seen as an outsider to get the job, with former players as the front runners. His background as a trial lawyer was far from the experience of an NFL player. Well, I definitely think that's a positive that he was an outsider. You know, guy coming in, he doesn't have all of the connections or, you know, any, you know, preconceived notions of what was happening before. And, um, you know, he can come in and kind of look at things clearly. I'm very confident. I'm confident that, you know, he can get things done, uh, whatever that may be. Um, he's presented his, uh, his stuff in such a way, and I think he's broken it down to the players in such a way that we can understand it. As much as he's an outsider, D is a DC insider, having grown up a stone's throw away from FedEx Field. You come out of the womb in DC, you, you get smacked, and then you're injected with burgundy and gold. On his resume, counsel to then Deputy Attorney General Eric Holder, and he also served on President Obama's transition team. Business worldwide. Um, in some way, shape, or form always touches Washington. It, it's one heck of a sports town. Um, so yeah, those are things that are inextricably tied to who I am. It uh, doesn't affect what I do, probably, um, uh, but, but hopefully affects it for the better. With the possible lockout on the horizon, Demora Smith has made it a priority to visit each team to help them understand the process. What this was in um, uh, one of the foul drawers in, um, in our office, and uh, slowly but surely, I'm going through every drawer, every cabinet. Why? You know, a great deal of our history on, on what we have done internally to be a stronger union is there. Mm -hmm. um, the one thing I'm blessed about is Gene was an incredible note taker. You know, here on the back, he had clearly uh, written out in, in longhand uh, a speech that I, I don't know whether he gave or was going to give, but the most interesting part at the bottom is um, you see it in quotes. The NFL has always been willing to take a short loss for a long-term gain. In the midst of negotiations, or perhaps because of them, D and the union have made national headlines on a regular basis. As executive director, my number one priority is to protect those who play and have played this game. To me, it is uh, uh, probably a little bit of a a combination of half negotiation, half trial lawyer. Um, I mean, both of those things are things that are that are uh, in my DNA for some way, shape, or form. Um, I think about my grandfather in the pulpit. There's probably a little bit of that too. Um, I, I, as a result, I'm really not afraid of any question. Um, I I want guys to be actively involved. Um, truth be told, I probably lean on them in a very hard way, but this is their union. It's not my union. It's their union. <laughs> Always in the line of fire. Ready to hit coach? Demora Smith is used to the heat. I thought that was it. And he certainly made it a point to go to Roger Goodell and say, I, let's negotiate now, let's do this now. And, and it's interesting now, you're seeing the posturing from both sides. The big thing with Demora Smith is he wants to educate his players mm -hmm. so they understand the issues, not only so they can understand what will happen in the lockout, you know, you got to save money, you got to do this, that, and the other thing, but so they can understand the issues so they can speak intelligently to you and me as right. reporters about those issues. Yeah, and big shoes to fill with uh, Gene yeah. Upshaw. And, and he knows it. And he goes right into the fray with that CBA, which is... <laughs> 
It's huge. It's huge and it's teetering at this point. He's used to it. I mean, he's tried big cases. He's worked big jobs. He's a DC insider. He knows the, the magnitude of this. It's a very interesting uh, personality.